Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I promised you guys that I would do a Zaffle review for you guys. Zaffle wrote to me again and asked me to do another video for them because they believe that their products have improved and that they're better quality. And so I thought, okay, I will give them a second chance. I asked you guys on Snapchat if you thought that I should and most of you guys said yes. So I'm going to give Zaffle a second chance. I'm gonna show you guys everything that they sent me and you guys can let me know what you think of them and if you think that they've redeemed themselves from the last video. So I have to say that the quality of the clothes that they sent me this time is much better than most of the stuff that they sent last time. But then again, I did get more expensive items than I did last time just because I wanted to see if the quality would be different for more expensive items than cheap items. I mean, with cheap items, you get what you pay for, right? So. I also did a secret shop with them. As you guys know, whenever a company sends me some items to review, especially if it's clothing, I always go on their website and purchase a few items anonymously just to make sure that they are actually sending me good quality stuff. And if you guys were to go online and purchase that, that they would send you the same thing. So I virtually go on there as a customer and buy something. And I did that this time and their stuff was actually good so maybe they have improved the quality of their stuff and it's not just a line or gimmick because i gave them a bad review but as i said i'm gonna be honest with you guys completely and totally honest i'm gonna try them on and you guys let me know what you think okay the first dress is this pink tie-on dress it's really cute i like the fabric it's really thick it's definitely for winter and it's not see-through or anything like that and it looks like it's stitched really well which is always a plus this one has a label on it lo and behold they finally put labels on their clothing the next dress i got was this gray ribbed dress i really like this dress i'm not sure about the neckline i'm not sure if i like the way that the neckline is cut but it looks really good on it's quite figure hugging as well and it's really quite thick the next item i got was this black long jersey dress I got this because it looked really cute on the model but when I put it on it didn't have the shape that I was expecting at all like it didn't have that slinky slouch that I was going for and I was a bit disappointed with this dress but I can't say anything bad about the stitching because the stitching is actually done quite well it does have wash labels on it so that is a definite improvement from Zaffle because the others did not have wash labels on it and when I went on their website this time around, they had letter measurements as well as actually having number measurements. So you can measure your waist and your shoulders and everything like that to make sure you get the right size. Now time for my secret shop item. I got this little maroon dress. Now I don't know if you guys are seeing this clearly on camera. It is actually a burgundy maroon color and not red. It looks red right now. And it was a little bit cheaper than the rest of them, but it's still stitched well. And lo and behold, labels. They have labels. Yes. Now I'm gonna show you some of the accessories that I got. I was so skeptical, I wasn't sure I was actually going to say this, but I actually love their accessories. You guys were totally right. They are definitely good at accessories. I got this bag. It looks exactly like the picture. I'm gonna show you the picture right there. This looks exactly like it. And this is one that they sent to me. Now, I was kind of skeptical when I saw it online because I was like, there's no way it's going to be that good. So I went out and did a secret shop and bought another bag exactly like this one, but in a different color, just to make sure that they look the same. And lo and behold, exactly the same, different color. The next item I got was this red little bag. Um, I'm not sure I like it, not because there's anything wrong with it. It's just that I don't like the style. I thought it was cuter online for some reason and as I've got it, I don't really like the colour and stitching it to me, it's just not my thing. Their accessories are just doing it for me, just, yes, I like Zaffle's accessories. I also got some sunglasses from them as well. These were only $7 and the quality of these are just ridiculous. I would pay £30 for these or more in Topshop. Don't mention if it was an actual name brand, like they'd be so expensive and they look so good. Each pair of sunglasses came with their own little case and they also give you a little key to make sure that you can tighten your sunglasses. The second pair of sunglasses I got were these. I love the style of these, they're just so, oof. as I said, it's really heavy. The quality of them look really good. It doesn't feel or look cheap and I only paid I think 
$12 for these. So that is the end of the review for Zapple. Let me know what you thought of the items that I chose. In their email asking me to do this review, they did let me know that they've improved the quality of their items. They've taken aboard what you guys said, especially because they were replying to you guys in my uh, comment section, which is really strange because most companies don't do that. And that's it guys. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to see this hairstyle, then let me know in the comment section and I will do it for you guys. Make sure you give this video a big thumbs up, give as many likes as possible, help a sister out, and I will see you guys in my next one. Love and kisses, guys. Bye.